What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. This is EJ Joyful Plans and in today's video I am decorating my horizontal layout with a new sticker book. This is the Whimsical Florals Volume 1 from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop, her first sticker book ever, which releases on October 20th. I'll leave information about this down below. This is a layout that I use for faith journaling, devotional, quiet time, I guess you could say. So I like to decorative date this layout. I like to have as much writing space as possible. And so I hope that this is helpful for you if you are a journaler or um, someone that uses a spiral bound, it doesn't have to be disbound, but anybody that has these horizontal lines and you need as much writing space as possible, but you still want it to look cute and still have a function, then hopefully this is helpful for you. So let's get into it. I think this will be a, a quick one because I'm realizing as I get further and further in my devotional. I want a little bit more writing space and I can always add more stickers later. So let's get into it. Whimsical Florals Volume 1. I do have a flip through on my channel um, of this sticker book, but we're just going to jump right into, I really want to go with the male theme just because I think it's just too cute. Too cute. So let's start with this post, post um, sticker or this mailbox sticker. And I gotta decide, do I wanna go low or high? I think we're gonna go low. And I am gonna cover up Wednesday, but I think that's all right. Already cute. Now, JoJo stickers are different than ones that you would find um, from similar shops. She has a different like paper type with some of these deco stickers. And so keep that in mind. It's going to have their, they have a much more luxurious feel to them. They're a little bit thicker. Um, and I don't know how to describe it. They're still matte, but they have more of a, maybe a vinyl feel, but they're not overly thick. So it's kind of hard to, kind of hard to describe it, but um, really nice feel on these stickers. And they just, I don't know, they look they look really nice. So <clears throat> these are on paper. I think I want to stick with the paper ones. And because these are going to more easily cover um, my days. Yeah, I think I like that. So I'm going to throw this down right here. And Remember, I'm decorative dating, so I don't care so much about the dates that are on here because I'm going to take them off or I'm going to replace them, I guess is the better way to say it. And this should show you guys how easy it is to make your journals look cute and still be functional. So I've just thrown down some postage stuff. And, <coughs> excuse me, um, let's go with maybe this guy. And I wanna mix in some more floral. Oh no! I wanna mix in more florals. That guy lifted up a little too roughly. I think we're still gonna use him though. Right there. And let's see, how about a postcard? And I think I wanna do another stamp. Be this guy right up there. Okay, pretty simple so far, right? Not breaking any molds here, but I really, really like simple, simple spreads for this planner. I might even grab a faith quote actually from, uh, mm, what sticker book? Maybe the faith basic like, sticker book. I'll come back to that in a second. Uh, I feel like I need more up here. Maybe we'll add this like open box with the flowers. 
right here? Or should I do that down in this corner? Maybe I'll do that in this corner. Because this corner box, yeah, because I can always write around it. Yep. Okay. Um, let's see. I think I want to add more florals to that, though. I feel like we need to kind of cover this corner. So I'm going to put this right there. Oh, you guys, I just remembered. I just remembered that along with this sticker book releasing on the 20th, Jojo has washi tape, and I think we should use some. So this one corresponds with the um, this set of illustrations. So I think we should break out some of this. And y'all know I love a ripped washi, so I'm gonna rip this in half. And I'm just gonna run this along the bottom here, just for a little, little extra. And do the same thing, take the other half and run this along the bottom as well. Pretty. I think we're gonna have to run it along the top too, because I like the way that that looks. So. Let's grab some more of this. And I think I want to go all the way across with this one. So let's see if I can go narrow because I want this to be a wider strip, but I still want the raw edge. So I'm going to try to rip as far to the edge as possible or as close to the edge as possible. And then let's see. Did I guesstimate my length okay? I think I did. Cool. Very pretty. Washi tape is another great way to add extra texture. <clears throat> Let's see. Let's do the same thing on the other side, just so it matches. I'm so proud of this girl coming out with these um, collections. I feel like she's just really growing her shop and it's really fun to see. Oh, you guys. Um, I feel like every other uh, video I, I say something about someone being sick in my house. The stomach bug came back. I had to pull Esther from daycare because of some not fun experiences she was having at daycare. I had to take her to the doctor and and then we all got the same stomach bug. Doesn't that sound like fun? So yeah, um, if you notice that I have a little bit lower energy than usual, that would be why I've been sick, super sick. Okay, so pretty simple so far, right guys? Like I haven't really done anything super crazy yet and it looks cute, but let's add some dates and then once we add in the dates, I'll get a sense for any other decor I wanna do. So I'm gonna grab the Date It sticker book. I have a full flip through of this guy also on my channel if you haven't seen it. <coughs> and I think I wanna go with like pretty script writing. I think it'll look nice. So let's go with, and I think I want to go with paper. Yeah, I think I want to go with paper. Okay, so we want October. Although, am I blind? I feel like I'm not saying October. September, September. If I were October, where would I be? Oh, I'd be over here. Okay, so we're going to add October up here, and yeah, I think I want to stick with this font. Ooh, but I like the smaller October. <gasps> Hold on, guys. Let's see if I can lift this up. 
And I think I'd rather do the small October. Yep, small October. And let's find our days of the week. Hopefully we have some small ones. Ooh, we should do big numbers though. I think big numbers would be fun. So, that was paper and clear. Yeah, so it's been a heck of a journey <laughs> with the family this week and, <clears throat> or in the last week. This week is this upcoming, well, when are you watching this? You're watching this on or around Esther's birthday, um, which is the 18th of October. So I'm really, at the time of filming this, I'm really hoping that we are all feeling a lot better um, by her birthday. I just feel like it would be really sad if she was still feeling icky, if we were all feeling still icky. So I'm gonna do the big numbers off to the side. And then I will add the days of the week. Um, maybe below them or next to them. Yeah, it's been quite a journey, you guys. I just feel like uh, people say that like once your kid starts going to daycare, be prepared to be sick like all the time. And like that they would get sick, but you would get sick too. And whenever I heard people say that, both when I was single and then when I was married but didn't have a kid yet, I just never believed people that that was like a thing. Like, oh, your kid's going to get all the sicknesses. They're going to be sick all the time and then they're going to bring their cooties home to you. Like I just never, I just never took it seriously. I felt like people were just being dramatic. Like that's not a thing. You guys are being dramatic. But you guys, it's a thing. Uh, I feel like we've been sick constantly since she went to daycare. And it's not fun. Not fun one bit. And I feel bad too with like my boss. I, you know, have had to call in sick. And I'm just like, I swear, I'm like, this is legit. We really are sick. You know, at what point does your boss not really believe you anymore? <clears throat> I have a good one. I have a good boss. <clears throat> Thank the Lord I have a good boss. And I'm a good I'm a good employee. And so, you know, he doesn't have a reason to not believe me. But um, you know, when it's all the time, I definitely start to feel like I'm pushing <laughs> pushing the boundaries of my of my supervisor. All right, so we need to find some days of the week and think I think there are clear ones in this font those are months 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 maybe I need to go further back here we go okay so there's the stacked do I want to go with the stacked did she give us an unstacked version I'm not sure she did but let me go backwards. Okay, here we go. So we're, I'm gonna go with the not stacked version and clear. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with clear. Do I wanna do abbreviated or not abbreviated? I think I wanna do not abbreviated just cause I think it's pretty. And let's see, I'm gonna go the second line down right there. For all of them. So by decorative dating, you can see that I have still like the bulk of the line spaces available. That is very important to me. So I have room for all of the writing. I decorated another planner for the week with um, a birthday theme. So if you're wondering, why is this one not birthday themed? I'll put a little birthday sticker in here too for Esther, but this is, uh, this is for me. This planner is for me, so I don't want to go overly 
make it about her. Although, let's be honest, my life is pretty much all about her now. <laughs> all right, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. <clears throat> I need to get my energy back, you guys. I think that's really what's been the hardest is I just, it's so hard to even like move my body after being so sick. I just have like no energy and it's very hard to care for a baby when you have zero energy. <clears throat> so if you <clears throat> are a praying person, please pray for my household and uh, all the all the people in it that do it all heal quickly. And that God would give us a break. <laughs> I would really love a uh, a break from the from the illness. That would be absolutely lovely. Okay, so I'm pretty sure there is a birthday sticker in here. Yes. So here's that font. But did she give us? Yes, she did. So my birthday, that's not my birthday. Was there a different one that was just birthday? No. So I think I might have to use this guy, although the font isn't not the same. Do I want to do that? I'm not sure it's necessary. In my devotional book, putting that's Esther's birthday. Mixed feelings. Put it down here. I'll just put it down here. Okay. I think I do want to put in a faith quote. So... Let me grab my Faith Basics sticker book and lay down a quote, and then I think we will be good to go, y'all. Um, I want a big quote. I think I want it to be in black font. Um, now I'm picking the right one. This is the hard part. <sighs> Be strong and courageous for the Lord your God is with you. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I could do a small quote in the lower corner if I wanted to do multiple quotes let your light shine before others that they may see your good works and glorify your father in heaven be truly glad there is great joy ahead oh that's a good one okay i think we do want to add a quote here and Hmm. Well, this is the hard part, guys. Were there more? I know there was the Esther quote that got me excited. I don't know if I want to put it in this planner, though. Um, his love, love forever. I think this might, I think this is supposed to say his love endures forever. I could be wrong, but... Someone look that up. Psalm 118 too. His love endures forever. Might be a typo there. Um, come to me all who labor and are heavy laden. I will give you rest. That is a great one. That one we are definitely going to use. Here. Okay. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so we've got that, and then I really want to put something up here. Let me grab another large-ish sticker. Ooh, that's cute. Hold on. Let's add this guy first, because he's too cute. I could do 
this instead of a quote. Uh oh. It's starting to. Oh no. Oh no. So I have to lift this back up because the last envelope was sinking too low. So I've got to go a little bit higher. Let's see, did I fix it? Something's not right about that. <laughs> now it's really crooked. Oh no, hold on, I gotta lift them up. Hope it's not too late. Although I think I might have, yeah, I think I killed the sticker. Hold on guys, I like this idea. We're gonna make it work. And I'm thankful that there are two, two of these guys. Let's first lay down some more of this, I think. We're gonna lift up the road because y'all know I'm all about it making sense, right? So that is the road. Let's try this again. We have one chance, one chance to make this work. Very cute. Now I kind of wish I didn't do that. Oh. Dare I? Are you guys yelling at the computer right now? Yelling at your phones? Whatever technology you choose to watch this on. Oh. Okay, I think I can salvage this. Oh, no, it just ripped. Oh, sweet niblets, Elizabeth. We're going to try to fix this. I want this dude on here because he's too cute. So I'm gonna put him here, right at the edge. And then we're gonna try to, <laughs> oh, we're gonna try to salvage this guy. We can do it. We can do hard things. We can do all things. Okay. See, why is it going down now? Oh, this might be a tricky sticker to lay, y'all. It is adorable, but you gotta be, you gotta be precise. I think that's as good as it's gonna get, which is good. Good for me. All right, cute. <coughs> I still wanna add a scripture though. Make sure this gets all flat. So now this kind of sets in motion the space that I have. So I want to put a small quote here. And let's see, I want it to be mostly vertical. Um, trust in the Lord with all your heart. Let's go with the Joshua quote. Joshua 1, 9. Be strong and courageous, for the Lord your God is with you. Unless it's going to be too big. I think it might be too big. Can we do it? I think we can do it. Nailed it. All right. Now I think we're done. <laughs> okay. Now I know that this looks very like left, left uh, leaning, I guess you could say, but <clears throat> trust me, once this is populated with writing, it looks really nice. And um, yeah, it's just a really fun journaling look. So let's pop these guys in. Sorry, I'm hiding my previous things. 
All right, I think we are done. We are done. This is my journaling spread for the week. Um, sorry, it was a little topsy-turvy here with this action, but it looks cute and I love it and it's gonna be fun to open up every day. That is it. If you have any questions about whimsical florals, leave them down below. This releases on Friday. Um, Faith Basics, I think, is already out and available to y'all. And so is the Date It 2.0, a sticker book for Mojo Jojo Plans. Um, this I have a uh, coupon code for. Affiliate code for here. And yeah, I feel like this is a sales ad now. But y'all always ask what I use in my videos. And so I'm just making sure you guys know where all the stuff came from. All right, friends, come hang out with me over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. It is always a good time. And if you want to hang out with me again, I sure hope that you do. Please consider subscribing to my channel. Until next time, friend, God bless you. God bless you and keep you. Do something creative today. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.